In this video, I wanna talk about Star Wars A Bad Batch season finale and episode 15 and 16. And we will also talk about the future, like predictions for season 3. So, spoiler alert. Now, the biggest thing that happened this season is Dave died. Now, after binging this series again, I could say that it was set up already. Like, you know, in movies, when someone gets a little bit of over explained characterization or an over explained backstory, or maybe something to fill for them, chances are they are going to die soon enough. And that that same thing happened to take this season cause we got to know a lot about him and he with the having a little flirty relation was also a dead giveaway for that and hence his death was kinda sad and at this point I was like Star Wars is not going to kill any main characters seeing the live action stuff. But an animated show, supposedly a kids show, pulled it off and made me emotional. And even if Dick comes back at season 3, I wouldn't mind cause the way he departed, that was amazing. And seeing the Dr. Hemlock's assistant as a clone was another new layer to the Clone War mythos cause now there are female clones and Omega is not special cause she's female. So yes, I'm pretty sure Omega is gonna come out as a force sensitive and the biggest thing I'm expecting in the season 3 or 4 would be Rex, Cody and the Bad Batch joining together for the final mission cause last season also Rex showed up in one episode and didn't show up in the finale which is a good and a bad thing cause this keeps the show dedicated to the main Bad Batch members but now since the Bad Batch members are two members shot well three members shot now i wouldn't mind cody and rex fighting together with them because that would be an awesome clone wars team up because we never got to see cody rex together working with the bad batch because if i'm right cody gets injured in the season 7 of clone wars so rex and his five of first boys goes to the mission so that would be nice so as of right now the mandalorian and the bad batch all are leading up to the sequel trilogy and Maybe Dr. Hemlock's experiments are what will lead to the formation of Palpatine's clone and from Mandalorian we know Pershing's experiment are all about cloning the Emperor stuff so yes, somehow Palpatine return will finally make sense now. And I am excited I guess cause I wouldn't mind if they made the sequels good for me like Clone Wars did to the prequels. Well, Bad Batch was a banger and I'm excited for season 3 much more than Mandalorian season 4. So that's all I got for today's video and hope you enjoyed my video and if you did please hit the like button subscribe to my channel and if not well don't dislike cause no one's gonna see that.